I'm Vinny, this is my day off, and you're very welcome indeed. Today I'm doing a cutting test with these two rather attractive knives. This is the case, um, True Sharp Stainless Steel in the yellow Delrin. And this is the Rough Rider 440 steel in old yellow as they describe it. I like these handle materials because they remind me of uh, an ivory handle knife, perhaps that uh, a gentleman would have had maybe in the 1850s or so. That's what they remind me of. This is not meant to be a serious live or die contest. This is just rather putting information out there for people who might be interested in buying them about their cutting abilities. The case knife my wife picked up for me, she went on a trip to the US recently and before she went I saw these were advertised at around $35, uh, which I thought is very good value, to be about twice that here on this side of the Atlantic. So uh, she picked this up for me in the US and Marty if you're watching, Thanks ever so much for your kindness and thanks very much for fixing me up with a knife. I really appreciate it. Thank you ever so much. Anyway, let's get on with the cutting test. By the way, my fancy chopping block, uh, be very careful, patent pending here. Also, it's no good getting older without getting wiser. The last time I tried this, I got a fine blister. So I have a band-aid this time on. The knives are themselves are very similar. Um, the main blades are just under three and a quarter inches. Um, and both knives are around about four ounces, but the case is a f just a fraction heavier. It's a little bit wider and it, it does feel more solid in the hand, I will say that. Anyway, let's go. Case knife first. And as you can see, this uh, this is three quarter inch polypropylene. I forgot to say that. And as you can see, it's quite a tough cut. And it's quite hard on edge. So that was 10 cuts with the, the case. And just one point I'd like to make about these um, this yellow Delrin on the case knives. It doesn't like um, being carried with a number of other knives in your pocket or lighters or clutter in your pocket. It, it I, I know this from the other knife, it tends to get a bit scuffed. So if you like to keep them looking well, you may need some little pouch or cover. Okay, 10 with the Rough Rider. Time with the Rough Rider. I must say the case did seem much easier. Right. Let's see how each knife is doing after uh, 10 cuts each. So this is the Rough Rider. Not too bad, certainly not as clean as it was. This is the case. That, that is much better. Right. 
Right guys, 10 more cuts. Case again first. Right, so that's 20 cuts a piece. And I can tell you, um, this Rough Rider is starting to struggle. It's, it's, it's pretty tough going trying to cut this, this rope with the Rough Rider. It's tough with the case as well, but it is, it, it, it is sharper this time. Let's see how they're doing with paper. This is the case knife. Not bad at all. Considering the work is, it's, it has done and the pressure I put in it cutting that rope. So here's our Rough Rider. Let's see how this fares. Hmm. It's pretty much struggling now, I must admit. And uh, I knew it cutting the rope, it was, it was uh, much harder cutting the rope. So the case is too sharp, it's not doing too bad. Let's give them another 10. So here's the case again. Now it's not, e not easy cutting this rope, um, this is the case knife again. It's not that easy cutting it, but it's much easier than with the Rough Rider. The Rough Rider is under pressure. I can tell you at this stage I'm quite happy to see the last uh, the last cut coming. Wow, the blade is really hot. So last ten for the Rough Rider knife. To be honest, I give up, guys. This is tough going. This knife is is um, not sure if the edge is rolled or what, but it's quite blunt at this stage, and this is no fun at all. So let's let's give them one last try in the paper. This is the case. Not exactly perfect, but it's cutting paper pretty, pretty well. This is the Rough Rider. This was really struggling with the rope. This, <laughs> that was hard work and not fun. Still cutting paper, surprisingly enough, I, I thought it would have uh, completely rolled or been compl fully blunt at this stage. This time I have to say, the case uh, stainless. 
was definitely the better of the two. As I say, this is, this is not a real contest. This is just putting information out there from people who might be interested in buying either of these. In my experience, both Rough Rider and Case are decent knives. Um, the Rough Riders, this rope is a very tough medium. If you're um, using these on wood and what have you, you'll do a lot of cutting on the Rough Riders before you blunt them. The Case are a bit better, but they are a bit more expensive. Nothing wrong with these Rough Riders. These are two pretty little knives and I'm going to enjoy both of them. Anyway, I hope this was of some interest to you. Thanks very much for watching guys, and bye bye from Venice Day Off.